Uh, what we're talking about now is a process called synchronization and what synchronization is is uh, our attempts to control when an animal or doe uh, does come into to, uh, estrus so that we can breed her uh, at predictable times. Uh, there are a number of different ways of, of doing it. Um, one of the ways of course is to use a, a, a hormone called lutelase uh, in, in, in cyclic animals. Uh, uh, we can give uh, two shots of lutelase at 11 day intervals and after the second shot about 30 to 36 hours later the animals should be in standing heat. Uh, that's one method. Another method th that they've used of course they can use just straight progesterone injections. Progesterone seems to uh, block uh, the internal hormones so that the animal does not cycle until you remove the source of that progesterone. And progesterone can be administered to the animal as an injection, as a food additive, or as uh, a, a vaginal insert. And in, what you're looking at here is uh, a material called uh, Cedar G, which is a, a, a plastic uh, polymer that has been in, in, uh, impregnated with pr natural progesterone. Uh, and what we'll do with this is insert it into the reproductive tract of the female and the fact that it's in contact with the walls allows that progesterone to come out into the circulation and, and prevents the animal from coming into heat. This is the applicator that we use to insert it into the vaginal vault and we put the cedar in here like so. These wings that you see on the cedar are specifically made so that when you insert this they spread out in the vaginal vault and will not fall out of uh, the female at all. So this is the inserter uh, and then um, we usually put a little bit of lubricant on the tip of this before we insert it and then we just put once we're in the track we push it in and the cedar stays in there and all you'll see sticking out of the vagina is this little plastic loop. And after a particular, a particular amount of time, anywhere from seven to say 15, 16 days, we can go and pull these and the animals will typically come into heat. Okay, the procedure that we used uh, in our trials here uh, involved the use of a hormone called GNRH or gonadotropin releasing hormone, which is a natural product released from uh, the central nervous system and controls the output of hormones which uh, regulate uh, the, the uh, cyclic activity in the females. Uh, we give a shot of this at the time that we insert the cedar. We re relieve the cedars in the animal for seven days and then at the, after the seventh day we'll remove the cedar and give a shot of a second hormone called lutelase. And uh, typically the animals will come into heat somewhere around 36 to 48 hours after removal of the cedar and the shot of lutelase and then we normally breed them about 72 hours after we, we remove the cedar uh, with uh, pretty good results. Alright now what we're doing is demonstrating how to insert the cedar into a, a female. Uh, this is a, a mature doe uh, and the first thing we do obviously is try and clean the entrance to the reproductive tract called this is called the vulva right here so that there's no dirt when we insert the the cedar dry it off okay uh, first thing we do of course is load the cedar into the applicator with the the plastic uh, line up close the wings together push it in up to those lines then we add some lubricant to the tip to help with the uh, entrance into the track. I usually put it in with this end up open it up and you'll want to go in there gently and kind of at the angle of the hip a little bit so that uh, you're not pushing against the wall like so then you push in pull out and your cedar is in. This is all that you have sticking out and then when you have to remove it, say seven days later you come in, grab this and gently pull it out.